Now we are going to start to create our own machine learning models in PHP. The very first decision that we need to make is to decide if we want to write the algorithms ourselves or we want to use libraries. For this course, we are going to use libraries that are well tested and include a lot of algorithms that we need. There are many libraries for machine learning in PHP, but as of 2023, the top libraries are PHP ML and Rubik's ML. Both of them are amazing. We are going to use PHP ML in this course, so let's require that in our project. Here I have a directory PHP machine learning and inside that I have index.php file. It, it's empty. I haven't written any code. So the very first thing is to include the library. Let me open the terminal. All we have to do is to write composer require PHP AI PHP ML. Perfect. It has required PHP ML to my project. As you can see in my vendor folder, now I have PHP AI and PHP ML. In this folder, you can go through all the files and see what algorithms are included, or you can read the documentation. For example, you can see we have a lot of algorithms for classification, association, clustering, regression. We are going to talk about some of them during this course. So let's get it started. The very first thing that we need to do in order to be able to use all these amazing algorithms is to require the vendor. So it would take care of also loading the classes. Require vendor autoload.php. Now we can use all these amazing algorithms in our code. That's it for now. Let's continue with our course.